Hi, welcome back to the Carver's Wood Shop. Now we're about to start, now that we have it all sanded down and where we should have it done here, I'm going to start showing you how to do the wood burning on this bird, okay? The way it's flowing on this bird here, and what's on our diagram over here, um, it's pretty darn simple. Um, and I'm going to take a pencil and start showing you the flow. So the flow is this way. It comes off the head like this, just like that. And I'm going to mark the whole bird so we know. And it goes up a little bit with a curvature, okay? And this is kind of... And I'll show you how to do this portion. And this gets swung upward, just like that. Okay? This will come out from underneath there, okay, just to show you that. And we're going to show you a little bit on the burning on that, and then we're going to do another segment on burning a little bit later. I'm going to turn my detail master on, which is a, um, which is a wood carving um, um, pen uh, that a lot of wood carvers have. They either have the detail master or some of the other ones. It has a dial on it. I'll show you over here if I can show you what it looks like. Oh, uh, right there. You can see it. Okay, that's our detail master. And um, I've got a lot of things on the table here. Um, but anyway, it gets very, very hot. And you want to be careful you don't turn it up too high uh, when you burn. All right? So we're going to go on to bat number four. I'm going to put my glasses on. And uh, the way... The first thing we're going to do, the bill has a separation on the bill. That line that you see right there. We're going to put that on first. So this is how we do it. Okay, that's our bill. And that separates the top from the bottom. And it can be curved a little bit if you like to get a little more realistic look. It's a little bit on the hot side. So... So what we're going to do is from the bottom of the bill, we're just going to start wood burning, okay? And what I do is I crisscross as I follow this path out. See how I'm going around? And you do another section. And kind of let the, let the wood burner do the work. Okay, we're going to go up here again. And we're going to crisscross it. like that. Okay. So that's how we're going to do all of this down here. I'm just kind of follow this down at an angle. I can show it to you. And we're going to crisscross it. Alright. We're going to keep following that all the way around. You know, maybe a an eighth of an inch to a quarter of an inch strokes. Alright. Alright, so that's how we start. Okay, and then on the top here, we're just going to flow it out a little bit like so. And around that eye. And you're just going to work it to the back here. Okay, this is going to go up just a tad here. Alright, so we're going to fill all that in. And then up here, what you're going to do, and I use my thumb as a holding point to give it some, so I can have it kind of stable. Okay, we're going to just take that right around. We're going to crisscross it. Just take your time with this. I'm just try trying to show you the flow of it. And then I'm going to go back when we're offline and do this a little bit better. But just to give you an idea. Okay? It's exactly how you want to do it. Okay? So we're going to fill all that in. We're going to crisscross it. 
we're going to do the whole breast area the way I have it flowing here, okay? And then on the next segment, I'll show you how to do these. So these are pretty well straight lines. You don't have to worry so much. The only thing is when you get to this portion here, you're going to make it a little deeper there. See, like that? Like it's coming out from underneath there. All right. Okay, and same thing here. You're going to put the tip of that, that uh, wood burn a little deeper right there. Okay. And the same thing over here, you're going to do the same thing. Okay, be careful when you get under here, you can turn it around to get under there a little bit better like this. Okay. Alright, so you just want to do that and crisscross it and try to follow your pattern out a little bit better. Okay. So you don't want to touch that edge too often just like I did there. Okay, so you're going to go underneath here and do all that the best you can up to the tail end. This gets nothing. We're going to clean that up with uh, sandpaper. I forgot to tell you that. Maybe you should do that before you burn everything. Um, this is flat and straight as well, so you want to go underneath here and do this section as well. Okay, until here. All right, and you're going to do this crisscrossing, and this is just really straight like that. Okay. And then when we come back, I'll, ta I'll tell you how to do these feathers. And they're going to be a little bit lengthy to do these, so I'll be back.